Oh, I'm going to have to tell Kyle and Larry. These starberries are perfectly ripe. Just squishy enough, and with a faint scent of musky cabbage. Now, if you can find me the sugar shrooms, she's all yours. For the discounted rate of one shiny gold coin. Wow, these sugar shrooms look amazing. Just the right amount of shroomy and not too sugary. Now, if you pass me one shiny gold coin, Grandma's giant star shroom pie is all yours. So you spent your only coin to buy that giant pie? I did. I knew that delicious smelling pie would somehow get me to the next round of the tournament. Oh, thanks for the patronage. Share this pie with a friend or two, or three. <laughs> and good luck in the tournament. told you it's not polite to go stomping around on people's backs. Give me one good reason not to gobble you up right now. If you let me go, I can return to you with bundles of royal food. You see, I I'm training to be a knight. If you release me, I'll make sure the king rewards you for your troubles. <laughs> You're a little scrawny for a knight. A long neck and a silly feather like that. <laughs> Are you sure you aren't a goose? Yes, I am quite sure I am not a goose. That's exactly what a goose would say. Lucky for you, Ulfie hates the taste of goose. The feathers are bad for digestion. Now, where do you want from Ulfie, Goosey? What are all those weird instruments around the bridges for? Usually those horns are used to summon its associated bridge troll to fill the gap. But we have removed all mouthpieces until we get word from the head of the guild. Ulfie was instructed to keep all his horns hidden from humans. <laughs> I keep mine under my butt. Shh. You wouldn't happen to know where I can find an eye of a beast, would you? Is it time for the tournament already? I thought that was on Tuesday. Oh, bother. My memory's failing again. Alfie's been suffering from sleep deprivation. A very rude monster has been snarling in the bushes behind my back. Is this monster you speak of hideous, perchance? Snarling Snarlax is legendarily hideous. Those puny guards of Daventry would surely be impressed by his eye. It is rumored the beast has two purple eyes with bright blue glowing pupils, six legs, three claws, and one tooth. I could let you cross and perhaps even help you with that fire-eyed monster, but since Ulfie didn't eat you, Ulfie needs a pick-me-up. This big tooth is a sweet one. If you bring me something to eat, I'll consider helping you. Can you share with me why all the bridges seem to be missing in Daventry? Well, little Goosey, until further notice, the Bridge Troll Guild is officially on strike. For too long have we, the Bridges, have been stomped on by sharp-pointed shoes of the puny guards. 
And do they care that my back breaks out in an itchy rash from all that marching? Of course not. As Pilar says, for shame, Daventry. We're not going back to work until the kingdom can take better care of their roads. I should be at the meeting. Perofi always shows up fashionably late. <laughs> right when the croissants are served. Happy trails. Waddle back briskly, Goosey. Ophi is starving. Thanks for the momentary lapse in conversation. Ulfie was unquestionably hangry. Now that I am refurbished, let us extract that snarling Snarlax eye. Earthquake! <laughs> it's all yours now. Whisper can do it. Uh, fret not, Goosey. It is the two-eyed Snarling Snarlax, after all. London Bridges! Whisper! I, uh, mm, Ophi has a new plan. First we'll... Then you'll... Then I'll... But first, you'll need this. Whenever you need me, just give it a blow. For those brave souls that are still with us, welcome back. Now, you may have heard some squawking from a few naysayers in our kingdom concerned with the ethics of the tournament. <laughs> but proclamations and addendums aside, this is the way we have always done it in Daventry, and this is the way we will continue to do it. Now, Knight Hopefuls, if you would be so kind as to present your eyes. Oh, hold still. Going to have to wait one second. I'll be right back. Is this hideous enough for you? Um, yes. This is... Uh, I don't think any addendums cover this. Congratulations, Graham! Welcome to the tournament! That troll is pretty ugly. Yeah, ugly in a sort of pretty way. That's not exactly what I meant. You know, like your cousin Hilda. Take that and that! Oh. Mr. Springbottom, what? You're surprised I'm competing in this stuffed animal tournament? You know what? I will make some stories of my own. <laughs> I'll pick up where my last book left off. It was called 31 Ways to Slay a Monster. You're just too adorable to fight, Mr. Springbottom. Let's dance instead. Twirling and best friends and twirling. <gasps> Gwendolyn! I'm sorry, Grandma. Oh, I'll take care of it, dear. I came to tell you your grandfather is ready for you. Run along, go have some adventures. Just try to have your next adventure away from my glass vases, please. 
Now it's time for my favourite part of the tournament, the duels. Ha <laughs> ha! You will compete against each other in a duel of strength and a duel of speed, with the winners facing off in a championship duel of wits. The pairings of knights were selected at random, so no complaining. I'm looking at you, Whisper. Any ties will be settled in sudden death. The winner, of course, will gain the knight position. The duel of strength will take place at our fantastical and wondrous floating island. And bring your steed to the tournament theatre for the duel of speed. Please unveil the tournament ball. I will remain here for any questions. And good luck to you. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I almost forgot. Has anyone seen that archer knight around? He probably headed home. He mentioned how hard it was for him to be away from his family. Whisper saw him headed towards the dark, scary well. Well, proclamation 4637371346737877633.1.5 states that any knight who voluntarily leaves a competition needs to sign the release form on the back of his portrait. We've had problems in the past. Do I have any volunteers to track down his signature? Wonderful. Thank you, Pockets. Here's his portrait. If you could get him to sign it, that would be great. And talk to me if you have any further questions. Let the duels commence! <laughs>